Hey, what is up you guys? It is your boy Diamonds here at Common Sense Graphics. And you already know what day it is today. Today is any Monday. It is June 1st, 2020. And uh, I just want to say hopefully you guys are safe and stuff or doing okay. Knowing that pretty much the whole country of the United States is in turmoil because of all the riots and stuff of what happened. And just I've been seeing a lot of videos of people getting hurt. And uh, just hopefully you guys are all being safe, you know, taking care of one another and things like that. But other than that, let's jump right into the video. So, you know, it's Andy Monday. And today, um, I put up another poll on Thursday of what to draw. And I got a vote for some Naruto characters. And I was like, okay, who am I going to draw a Naruto character? I haven't drawn Sakura. So, I drew an older version of Sakura. I drew uh, Boruto's version of Sakura. I had a few references. And they're not bad. And so, I told myself I'm going to try just drawing one of the images as best I can and uh, I did a pretty good job minus a few things here or there that just didn't look right at the end but uh, yeah let's jump right into my experiences with making this image and so in typical Domin's fashion I started off with the skeletal form you know the big circle as the base triangle as the torso area and then I do like the big old noodles as the arms and stuff and uh, you just, I just start feeling my way through while making the character it's kind of a lower up angle the camera's low pointing up at her and so it's not too difficult but it's pretty much almost a straightforward image she's just standing to her side a little bit like imagining her looking at you at her one or two o'clock that's what it would be like so it's pretty close to a 12 o'clock position so it's not that hard to draw and when you're just uh, able to just draw your characters like this with a reference it's 10 times easier and in my opinion while creating this skeletal form I was drawing it up and cleaning it up at the same time as I was drawing it just to help myself up so it doesn't get too cluttered with all the lines and stuff and I just took my time as you see the body is now starting to come together the uh, the skeletal form really does help out a lot and in typical diamonds fashion what I always do for the heads is always draw like a big little circle this one actually was a better circle and draw the lines to it just to show placement of items and stuff such as eyes nose and mouth features and uh, really just uh, take your time with it when it comes to drawing fan art I keep on saying it again on all my anime days whenever I'm drawing the fan art that it's probably the most easiest thing to do when you're drawing a character because you have a reference when you're looking at something and you're able to draw it. it's 10 times easier than just freehanding so that's why I say that if you're gonna be practicing and stuff this is the way to go to improve your own art style just because it's a fast way just so you can get a feel of drawing a character without tracing it and if I were to go over some hardships I had while creating this image I'm gonna to to talk about uh, the hands um usually hands for me is always a difficult thing sometimes I can make a really nice hand every once in a while but most times my hands uh, they are either like really noodly or like they have these weird bends that fingers should never have or they are going to be a bit more blocky or what I do just because I'm not really good at drawing all five fingers is I will block out some of the fingers and that could be like a pro tip you can figure out a way how to draw a hand by drawing less features usually I try my best to draw usually only about three fingers shown unless I have to actually draw all the fingers and usually usually you can tell when I draw hands like that that they are the ugliest uh, for example the hand on her her left hip the one I'm drawing right now uh, when I start finalizing it I realized that wow I did not take my time with it I should have took my time with it but I did not if I would have took my time with it it would have came out a little bit better but it looks kind of weird and funky and I told myself well that's that I didn't want to go back over it and that's probably a really bad trait for a lot of artists uh, in every form factor in terms of digital physical doesn't matter what you look at uh, telling yourself that oh I'm gonna go back and fix it and then you don't it's just being lazy and that's what I was doing and another thing that I kind of messed up on while creating this character uh, when I was finalizing her more focused on her head her hair I completely had forgotten a part of her hair that I did not draw in at all and I was like what what why does it feel like her head's really small her hair is really small what am I missing here and thank goodness I have a reference photo I looked at it and I was like oh I'm missing half her head and so I had to redraw that part and it was funny I laughed at it I was chuckling as uh, that was going on and it just it was just a good time and I am now starting to wrap up the image we're gonna put the head on the character here soon but um, pretty much that's it uh, make sure you guys have fun when creating your fan art make sure you don't stress too hard 
and I uh, cannot stress this enough but really I say it in every single one of my videos can't stress it enough really go back to your basics and use the skeletal form figure out a method of skeletal form that works for you my method is a very simplified method got the base big circle upside down triangle for the torso circles on the edge of the triangle for the shoulders and then I just feel it out after that there's so many different skeletal forms you can use to draw your characters just to get your body position down my position mine is pretty basic and pretty easy and it works for me but my way might not work for everyone but um, yeah the image is now coming together we're now towards the end of the video I'm going to speed it up like I always do for the finalization phase hope you guys enjoyed everything but you already know who would be it's your boy diamonds here at common sense graphics hope you guys enjoyed any money hopefully you guys enjoyed Sakura from Boruto Naruto and uh, all that bullshit make sure you hit that like button comment subscribe all of that and uh, wait next Thursday for my next poll for my next Annie Monday and uh, don't be afraid to vote or comment a request because that's where the place to put it at so i can put in my drawings for monday that's where i let my viewers my fans and stuff put their ideals forth for me to draw and it's always on monday but yeah your boy out